we're making the Mercy Mercy, which is an original cocktail uh, that hopefully could be confused for a classic. And we're going to start with two ounces of gin. For this, I like an old Tom style gin. It's a little sweeter and more full bodied. And to that, we're going to add half an ounce each of two modifiers, one being Aperol, which is a bitter orange liqueur from Italy. Which will also give it some lovely color. And finally, uh, Cocchi Americano, which is an aperitif wine. We're going to add two dashes of Angostura bitters. And then we're going to crack some ice to stir. This is always fun. You can relieve some stress. I use the back of a spoon. You can use a towel and a rolling pin or anything you have in hand. What we like is mostly dry ice of several different sizes. And if you have the time to frost your mixing glass beforehand, that can't hurt either. So we're going to stir this drink on the outside of the glass, spinning it with the ice. We're trying to achieve both chill and dilution, so you're adding both cold and water, or subtracting heat as your physics teacher would have taught you. going to serve this drink straight up in a cocktail glass. Add a little ice water or club soda and ice to the glass beforehand to chill it. You'll know you've added the right amount of water if it fills the glass appropriately without overfilling the glass. And the fun part, we're going to give it an orange twist, and in this case a flamed orange twist. You always want to use a nice fresh orange with a shiny skin. Always try to cut your twist without too much pith so you don't get any bitterness. And then in order to flame an orange twist, let the sulfur burn off your match because no one wants that in their drink. You're going to hold the twist in your hand so that you can easily pinch it directly over the match. And this is the Mercy Mercy.